Hello everyone, Black Ice here, and welcome back to Spelunky. Let's get started as usual with our daily challenge. I've been doing quite a bit of practice off camera, not a whole lot to show for it, but I do have something to mention once the daily challenge is over, whether or not I make it extremely far in that. Um, so, let's, let's just go. Regular Spelunky guy, as usual. Because all the other characters have been bad luck for me so far. Alright. Um, 500, there we go. I think that's already better than my last daily challenge run. Which is very, very sad indeed. But right after that, I had like the best run ever. For me, anyway. Uh, recorded right after that, so... Kinda worked out, sort of. But I will hopefully try to be a lot less stupid in this run. So far, so good. But I would like to get Pugzel or something. Oh, there's some bad stuff over there. I think I can take care of all of that, though. Yeah, that shouldn't go off. And I'm gonna wait for him to get back to the other side. Because now I'm gonna kill him and trigger both arrow traps. There we go. Oh, there's a crate there. It's not worth it. Because I don't know how to bomb to it properly, so I'm not going to try to do that. Um, is there a Pugzel over here at all? Nope, and that's exactly what I didn't want to do. So it was trigger that bat, but ended up being not too much of a problem. Maybe that works. Okay, I want to get down here so I don't make a stupid mistake and kill myself on those spikes. Where'd the rock go? And whatever, we'll find... Yeah, there, there it is. Okay, and there's Pugs. Alright, so yeah, this is this is perfect. Pugs is like right there. We can get him, we can get the rock. And there's a couple of chests. So this might be a very good 1-1. One, one. And let's grab this. Gemage, coinage, more gemage. Alright, uh, let's see what's in here, too. It's not hurt to check this place out. Not a whole lot. Yeah, that's what I was worried about, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna ignore him, because he can't... he can't get to me. He ain't got nothing. Alright, and instead of risking it, I'm just gonna grab this and go. I'm not gonna open up the pot, just in case there's something bad inside. Thank you, Pugzel, for your services. Um, let's see, what's in here? Nothing this way. Oh, wait. Yeah, we do have something over here. But I don't want to trigger that just in case there's the Ujot Eye. And there's my nemesis, the big spider. Um, yeah, it's worth it. I'll grab it. Why not? Uh, hopefully I'll be able to take care of him this time. I've been really bad at this lately. Um, okay, that's not going to trigger him. Um, how high can I jump? I can't really jump that high, but I do have to practice taking these guys out. There we go. That's a perfect shot. Awesome. Sticky paste is mine. Snake is dead. And I also get the gemage from killing him. And I'm going to just take care of the spider. Actually, forget it. He he's fine. He's not coming to life. Some coinage up there that I can't really get to. So I won't bother. What's down here? Alright. Nothing much. This bat might be a problem though, but not if I do that. Perfect. And it triggered the arrow trap just as I had planned it to. And I'm just going to kill him before he becomes a problem. Alright, now how do I want to do this? There we go, and jump across. It's down here. Okay, I can land there safely. I can kill you. Ooh, there's a box of bombs. I don't think I should rob the shopkeepers now. Things are going alright for me. And what's up here, actually? Just a vault? I didn't see pugs in this level. Is this a pugless level? Can such a thing actually exist? Because I didn't see him anywhere. I didn't even hear him. How much is box bombs? 10,000. Ooh, that is... And there's a Cali altar over there. Okay, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna bite on it. Nope. I will get bombs elsewhere. And if I don't, well... 
then it's my fault for not having bombs. But we do have sticky paste. We only used one bomb. That's pretty good. Still at five health. This is already going better than all my practice runs, which is good and bad. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Okay, I almost jinxed it right there. Okay, there's the there's the key. It is accessible, so that's good. Actually, I'm gonna go over here just to see if I can see the chest. Nope, but there's some crates that look nice. That might be worth a rope if I can get up there. I mean, there's two crates. It's gotta be worth the rope. I mean, worst case scenario is I get more rope. Uh, we're gonna kill you. Gotta be careful not to kill myself. Kill you. Um, see, I can trigger that thing with the key. Actually, I'll drop the rock rather than the key. Come on. Uh, there we go. Spider dead. What's down there? Not the, not quite the exit. I'm gonna leave the key and pugs over there for now. And here's where I would like to use my rope. And it will also get me another. See, I already got the rope back. It'll give me another chance to view further over into the level to see if the chest is over there. Because if it is, I gotta go get it. And a web gun. Okay, I still can't see it, so I'm gonna. Well, that was dumb. I pressed the button to grab the rope, but Spelunky guy over here did not want to grab the rope. Oh, whatever, let's just go. Hey, get down there, Key. You really gonna do this? Come on. Alright, and I'll grab Pugs as well. Um, I really hope the chest isn't in there. Okay, it's right down there. That's pretty good, then. Let's grab this coinage while we can. We'll get that one health I lost back from Pugs, so that's good. I don't know what those things are, but I don't think I want to mess with them. Alright, alright, Pugs, let's go. Another bomb shop. Let's see, it's another chance for me to buy bombs. I'm gonna grab this projectile. I, I might think about getting the smaller one, maybe. No. No, I'm not gonna do it. Although I need them for the black market, I I'm just confident that I'm gonna find bombs. I don't know why. And the thing about the daily challenge is you don't really want to spend money if you don't have to. I don't really have to right now. I mean, I'm doing pretty well. Again, I don't want to jinx it. Um, let's see, there's a Cali altar here. I don't want to set that boulder off because it's going to anger Cali. And that's not what I want. But unfortunately, let's see, I can take care of this guy after a few jumps on his head. And then I'm going to have to deal with that bat, like, right away. Alright, and you are dead, sir. I did not take care of the bat like I had planned to. Um, but I do have an idea. And that is to... Fail miserably while trying to jump on a bat's head. Ooh, that was close. Okay, get some gemage in here. Coinage here. And I have nothing to set that off with. Unless I do this. Haha! -ha. Oh, it was set off already, okay. That works. Okay, there's a scorpion up there, I don't want to mess with that. So I won't, because scorpions are dangerous. Pugs is over there, I can grab him. Oh no, but that scorpion could see me fall down. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna jump. And let's kill both of those guys. And let's set this off. And let's... Oh, man. I'm gonna use the rope. It's worth it. I already have extra rope, and now I have more extra rope. Dang it. I was really hoping that would be bombs. Thank you, Pugs, for smashing that spider. And you're gonna have to smash a bat for me in a second there, buddy. Thank you. Alright, and don't want to mess with those TNT things. Those are extremely sensitive. They can, they can end your run pretty fast. Okay, um, not worried about the scorpion, he can't see me down here, so might as well get this gemage. Doing pretty well. 46,000. Five hearts, and we're in the jungle. My only concern at all is my lack of bombs, and... Ooh, I didn't mean to do that. That was a bad mistake. Okay, is there any bombs over here? Nope, but there's some... There's a gem. 
it's down here. It's a relatively safe drop if I do this. There's a crate and a chest. Spiky shoes, I'll take those. Thank you. Um, really, I can't get up there now? Yes, I can. Okay, Pugs is trapped in a wall. I'm probably not going to be able to get him. That's okay for now. Let's see. How's the drop there? Oh. I might be better off just... Oh, that was not better off. I thought I could make that, and I didn't make it. Oh, come on. I'm taking combo damage from this dang frog over here. Oh my god, really? Well, that quickly turned bad. You know what? I'm just leaving. I'm just leaving. I need to get a, I need to get pugs. That's what I need to do. Well, that was probably the. This is why I hate the jungle. It just all the things that go wrong, that can go wrong usually go wrong like that. Let's jump so he doesn't annoy me. There we go. All right, I can drop here. I can make that jump, but he might come alive. I have to take the chance. <laughs> it didn't pay off. He would come alive. But overall, I think that daily run wasn't too bad. Because it's not about how far you make it, it's about how much money you get. And I got like 55000 that's not bad. There can be worse. I I'm okay with this, but I'm kind of mad because I could have done way better. That run just, as soon as I hit the jungle, just way downhill. Alright, and... Oh... Oh, what the fuck? You started playing. I, uh, that's pretty cool. Sweet. Awesome. Did you... Oh, yeah. I guess start playing this every day. Alright, um... Well, that was fun. Let's go back, and I'm going to do some adventure mode now. Um, I'm gonna go to play game, adventure... I do want to show you guys something real quick, but... Like... It's good and bad. Someone was kind enough to tell me that I have Tunnel Man shortcuts that I can use, and I'm like, yeah, that's perfect. Why didn't I think of that? And I can't tell you why I didn't think of it. But when you go over here, you can see I got a shortcut to the jungle and to uh, the ice caves. What do you have to say? Okay. The only problem is... Um, you know, let's just select the ice caves and say we want to go as far as we can. I already lost the game, and the reason for that is I have almost no way to get around here, and the ice caves are a level where you need some kind of method of uh, better transportation. Oh, this is a dangerous place to be. Uh, let's jump on your head. Oh. oh my god. Oh man, did I luck out there. Alright, Pugs, let's go. Aha, take that, Yeti. Let's get out of here. <laughs> we just gotta get out as fast as we can here. Because the ice caves are a level that if you guess wrong on where the exit is, you lose. Because you, there's situations that you can't get yourself out of just because of how open and stuff the ice caves are. Ooh, okay, that was risky. <laughs> let's take our projectile. Okay, there's Pugs. Um, oh boy, we're gonna have to jump on your head and hopefully live. Yeah, we lived. Alright, it's the exit here. If the exit isn't here, I may lose. That looks like it's probably the end of the level. No exit. I can grab pugs, though, just in case. Oh, man. Like, the thing is, if I go too far down there, it's over. Um... Here, what I can do, I'll burn a rope and get up here. And I'll use this to... I got blocked, but hey, oh no! Oh man, if only physics were somewhat realistic in this game. But see what I mean? It's just, you fall into the abyss, and I did guess wrong. I was able to get out in that case, but uh, we're just going to continue. And I'm going to show you what happens if you pick the jungle. I mean, the jungle is just a bad idea, no matter what, but... It's no avoiding it, really. But we're gonna pick the jungle instead of just starting at the mines. Like, what I'm trying to get a point, or the point I'm trying to get across is that the shortcuts, while they're they're great for being farther in the game, they're not really worth it because it's really difficult to actually 
take advantage of them. Like, I died in the second level of the ice caves, and that's only because I got the f I got lucky in the first level. And actually... Hmm... Is there piranhas in there? No. Perfect. I got an idea. I'm gonna try to go to this new level that someone told me about. And let's jump up here. And let's just avoid these guys. We need pugs for this. Oh, come on. Get out of here, you monkey. Alright. We might need another rope to make this happen. Jump on your head. Yes, we do. No, that's okay. Because this will be cool. Now, if we do this and let pugs go. Why? Okay, there we go. We're going. Ha ha ha. And we just got eaten. What did we get eaten by? A worm. Giant worm. This is a pretty cool level, so I'm pretty glad I get to show it off. I've never been here before, though. And I know it's really hard. Um, there's lots and lots of different hazards you gotta watch out for in this particular level. Alright, let's... Can I get pugs? Why am I jumping up when I want to go down? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Get out of here. See what I mean? They're everywhere. And those things, that those little spike balls traveling around, you really gotta watch out for those. And they don't stop. And there's some crazy music in here, too. Let's see, how do I get through here? Can I... No, I can't. I can't break these right now. Let's watch out. Oh, what a jerk. He targeted me, man. Okay, I'm gonna have to try to go down here. Oh, no. Pugs. Please live, pugs. Oh. Well, I'm stuck. Let's try to get our way out of here. Parkour! Oh my god, that worked. Um, oh, apparently you can destroy those pretty easily. Well, that's good to know. And I just need to... Oh, my, oh no. Leave me alone. Oh gosh. Uh, let's get out of here. No, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Alright, let go. And now we go down. These won't get me, right? I'll be okay. I'll be okay. Oh, oh no. Am I dead? I'm dead. That's a pretty cool level. I like it, but... Again, it's... Those shortcuts usually aren't worth it, so I'm just gonna go from the top. Take it from the top. Let's go to the mines. I mean, you just usually get more items and stuff, and... I don't know, just for me they don't seem worth it because I just don't do well when I take the shortcuts. Not that I do particularly well when I don't take the shortcuts, but you know what I mean. Oh, and I got a parachute. For me that's actually useful, which is kind of sad. Yeah, a lot of times parachutes can get in your way. Especially if you have like a jetpack or something. But see, I'll also have more health coming into the level, I have more supplies. It's just, for me, it seems like a better idea to just start from the mines, but... Let me know what you guys think, because I can do the shortcuts if you want. I mean, it kind of paid off there a few times. I mean, I got to the worm for one of them. And then for the other one, I did advance the level in the ice caves, and if I get lucky enough, then that can continue to happen. Um... Now let's take care of that spider. Thank you, pugs. And there's a rock there that I'm going to grab. Is there anything over there worth it? Not really. And since this is no longer the daily, I don't care about money. I'm going to be more likely to buy things at shops and stuff. Because that's all you can really use it when you're just trying to get as far as you can. Just get money, buy, use it to buy items, and... Oh, man. I don't know the best way to tackle this guy. That wasn't it. Okay, we did get more bombs, though. Hey, come on over here, guy. No. Oh, is he gonna kill himself in those spikes? He might. I'm trying to, like, leave the bomb in these webs. 
Haha, -ha, you're gonna die now? Oh, you jerk. And it takes a forever and a day to like jump on him to death. Oh no, leave! Okay, good, we're gone. You have not defeated me this time, although I don't have sticky paste, which is kind of annoying. But there's a shop right there. I did waste a few bombs too, so... There's some bombs, what do you know? Alright, what do you got? Definitely take the climbing gloves. Definitely take the compass. Um, yeah, I'll take the bombs. It's not the daily, so I don't care. Uh, now I gotta find pugs. Since I have the climbing gloves, it makes it, the job a little bit easier, since I can just climb up all the walls. Were you up here, pugs? No. Okay. It's probably on the other side. Let's take our projectile again. Got you. That bat's stuck. And Pugs is probably stuck somewhere because I haven't seen him at all. Uh, let's just take this guy out and move on with the level. No Pugs, but whatever. We'll find him in the next level. No Jedi here either, so gotta watch out for that as well. Oh man, a dark level. And the Ujot Eye is probably here too. Let's just go there. Let's go here. Throw this at him. Throw it at him too. There we go. Got that side lit up a little. That's probably the way I'm going to take down. Alright, I want to stand back a little bit. That was not what I wanted to do. But at least the torch landed like right there, which isn't too bad, I guess. Oh, come on. See, whenever... Just bad luck always happens to me in this game. I'm probably not going to make it out of this dank dark level. Oh, okay, there's a chest there. Kill you before you spit on me. And we did get a scarab, so at least there's that. Nope, you're going to have to die, guy. And let's just... Grab the ledge. Alright. Um. I'm gonna drop that down just so I can see. There we go. That worked out pretty well, actually. And I would really like that scarab, but he's gonna be running away from me. I hear pugs. What is that red light? I guess that's the shopkeeper. And I have to buy pugs in this level. Oops. Did not mean to do that, but I'll grab the scarab anyway. Oh, where did that guy come from? See, that's why dark levels are bad, because scorpions come out of nowhere. Alright, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. But hey, we saw a new level today, so I think that's an accomplishment. I am, and I mean, the daily run was pretty good too. I mean, for me anyway. Really? Oh, why did I do that? And, ooh, okay, that was close. I still have trouble grabbing the dang ledges in this game. It's really annoying. Okay, he's not coming to life. Uh, so I can grab this gem engine here. And I do hear pugs. Is he down here? Or is he up? He could be up. Nope. Alright, that's okay. Grab this. Um, can I kill you with the crate? Uh, I probably not. Whatever. Bombs! Thank you very much. Okay, there's Pugs. Is he accessible? Probably. That was a bad idea. I don't know why I threw the, the pot like that. And Pugs is accessible. I also have another projectile. I'll just leave it out there because I need to bring Pugs back anyway. And this will save me the trip. Alright, where did that projectile land? All the way over there. Alright, so this is so far a uh, pretty good 1-1. One, one. Probably gonna come out with at least 10 grand, especially if I get this. There we go. And on to 1-2. I really want to make it to past the ice caves. Ooh, cool, we get the 8-bit music. Or I think it's 8-bit. It sounds cool. It's old. Let's just call it 8-bit. Alright, and we can go through here. It's a crate. More bombs. Very nice. I don't know why sometimes this music plays and sometimes like different music plays. 
I don't think it signifies anything, but I like this music. It's pretty cool. Reminds me of my childhood when all video game music was like this. Well, pretty much. Anyway. Um, let's trigger you. Oh, he's got some good stuff. He's got some good stuff. I definitely want the climbing gloves. Oh, okay, I can't mess with that big spider, though, or else he'll get mad at me for breaking his shop. Is that... Okay, Pugs is up there. Eh, he's worth a rope. You're worth a rope to me, Pugs. Ropes aren't that great. But a bomb, on the other hand? No way. Hey, whoops, sorry, didn't mean to do that. Let's open you. Okay, whatever, you're gonna get stuck by the web anyway. Well, maybe not, because I'm just that I'm just that fast. Pugs, stop it. Get back here. Alright, there we go. And I guess we can just go down here. Hopefully yeah, there is or wait a minute, I can't get to that one. May not be a projectile down here. Let's see, if I drop you this way. Um, I need to go down one more block. Yeah, you'll be safe if I do this. Oh, that was pretty cool. Snake came out of the pot, arrow trap immediately killed it. And I'm gonna have to take this arrow for a projectile here, because I didn't see one down there. Um, I don't want to use it on him. Alright, but we will go here, grab this. See, this is going even better than the daily, other than I don't have as much money this time. Mainly because I spent it, but still. Okay, um... I don't care that the spider gets triggered, because I can just do that. Come on, give me the pot. And... Do I want to take this? Nope, because that shopkeeper's going to get real mad if I do it. And I don't mind making them mad, because I'm probably going to have to do that in the black market anyway, if I can get there. That's a big if, too, because I still haven't seen any part of the Ujot Eye yet. Um, I don't want to go in there. Eh, whatever, I can do that. Trigger you. Whoops, that was not the pot. Alright, nothing in there anyway. Grab the gemage. Okay, trigger the bats. They'll all come through here, so that won't be too bad. There we go, they're dead. And is anything up there? I kind of, you know what, I can get up there, what am I thinking? Um, anything up here at all? Um, I still would like to check a little bit more. No, okay, no Jedi, that's fine. Man, you gotta love these climbing gloves. Alright, got that. Scorpion's stuck anyway, so... That's fine by me. Spider is dead. And let's just not throw this at the scorpion, actually. Because apparently if you throw it at an enemy, you're guaranteed not to get anything from it. I'm just going to duck here and kill you. And kill you. Or maybe not. Well, I have to. Yep, I don't know how I managed that, but he's dead. But no pugs, no Ujot Eye. Let's see, is there anything up here that I missed? Can't really check unless I go down here. All right. Um. Nope. I'm nervous. I don't think that was one four. No, it wasn't. Okay, we're on one four now. So I need the Ujot Eye here. It has to be here. If it's not here, then I missed it. Okay, it is here. Good. Oh wow! How convenient. Now I just need Pugs, and we're fine. And he's right there. Is he accessible though? Yeah, it looks like he probably is. Uh, let's just jump across this just in case that guy wants to come to life. Ooh, he does. I hate those dang skeletons. Did not mean to do that. I don't know what I was thinking there. Um, I'm going to trigger him anyway because I can just make this jump and Pugs is this way anyway. I uh, try to hit the spider there. Let's see, can I make it down there? Yes, I can. Okay, those went off already, it looks like. Is that a boomerang? I don't need a boomerang. 
you gonna come to life? Not anymore, you're not. Lots of good stuff over here. And what is that, a machete? Yeah, it's a machete. I don't need the machete either. This chest over there, I'm not gonna go get it. We're fine. We are fine. Oh, and the bats. I forgot about them. Well, this one I can get for sure. Alright, Pugs, you were free. Bat jumped on your head. Uh, broke the pots, grab a rock, and we are onto the jungle with the Ujat Eye. Hopefully we'll at least get to the black market in this run. I, I had a practice run where the black market was like right next to the start. It was like literally, oh. Okay, we already got some Ujat Eye ticks, but I don't see it anywhere. Okay, it's ticking more. You know what? I think I see it actually. It'll cost a few bombs to get there, but it's doable. Oh, and we're getting stuff out of it. I think it's... Oh, that's... That was a miss... Miss button thing. Alright, there we go. There we go. And... So, black market unlocked. What's in here? Rope. That's not bad, I guess. Let's see. How am I going to rob these shopkeepers, though? You know what? I can get pugs down here, and it's only gonna cost me one bomb. There's also a crate. I'll do that. Oh, the, I forgot about the. Ooh, I got lucky there. That shouldn't have happened. I forgot that the vine would get destroyed. Bad mistake. I might have to. You know what? I can make that jump. Uh, let's see. I'm not gonna go in with the projectile, though. Eh, whatever. That's okay. I want the Ujat Eye to shut up anyway. Alright, I don't have enough to buy the Ankh, nor will I have enough to buy the Ankh. I have no gun. Virtually no way of dealing with these guys. See, if this wasn't here, I could totally rob this guy. <sighs> okay, I think what I'm gonna have to do is... Just throw a rope here. Throw a bomb and... Just climb the rope. I just gotta hope I kill these guys. Whoa, whoa, okay, he's a little close. Okay, he fell. Nope, he didn't though. Oh, that was a bad idea. I thought he did too, because I didn't hear him at all. Oh well, that was a pretty good run. I just need to work on robbing the shopkeepers. Once I master that, then... Spelunky's gonna get a whole lot better for me, but I'm gonna practice that more off camera. Anyway, that's gonna do it for me for today. So thank you all for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye everyone. Have a great day.